So that last white birch log, that was the maximum capacity of that machine. It says it's 400 millimeters is the maximum capacity, but in reality, 16 inches, that was like 17 and a quarter inches at the big end. So I had to maneuver it around to get it in, but it's capable of doing it. And luckily our customer is looking for very coarse split wood. So I just put my four way on, send it through and uh, away we go. So this is, this is actually, well, that's the third cord that'll be filling once this trailer's full this morning, it'll be three cords and it's uh, 9.36 in the morning and one cord, trailer's full. I got one cord already in this trailer, so we're gonna fill the deck again, keep on plugging away. Gotta try to get as many done as we can possibly get today. So we'll see how it goes. All right, let's get moving.
here's my eight-way and my six-way knife. And I've got to swap the four-way knife now. Get rid of that fellow. And when you take that out of the hole, you got to clean the hole out. I do it almost every day, especially in the wintertime, because if it freezes, this will end up not being able to be adjustable. So that's as easy as it is to change the knife, the wedge from a four-way to a six-way or to an eight-way or 12-way or 16-way. And uh, it's important that people, your customers, now there, get the wood that they pay for. So I don't mind making sure that's a little fine or a little coarser if that's what they ask for. Sometimes you don't even know that until the, the next year you're selling the wood and they wish it was a little finer, you know, or is, can you cut it a little shorter or, or can you split it a little coarser because we found we were feeding the wood stove with these smaller pieces too often. And if you don't ask the questions or if they don't volunteer it, then I guess you just got to ask. Make sure that are you satisfied with the wood and if not, what can I do to make it better? So that's about it. This is the final reminder. <laughs> the entries are supposed to be in Labor Day weekend a few weekends ago, but... Uh, Anybody that wanted to compete in the uh, firewood challenge, the fastest cord on all three categories, just go back a few videos to my 500th video where I announced the rules of that, and I'll still take I'll still take the uh, the time now, and we'll count it towards your your time. I'm not it's not that big a deal to me. So you got a chainsaw and a splitter, two guys, a bar processor like mine with two guys, and a circular processor with two guys and I'm going to take the best time of each if you tag me in your video I'll add a link at some point in the videos probably over well, this fall I'll make a, a playlist up with all of those videos the people that have competed in that time and the winner gets uh, a root beer on me at next year's Ohio um, International Firewood Expo that Ohio Woodburner Joe puts on so Joe we turn him to be pretty good friends and it's amazing you know we, I met these guys at the firewood expo and i met a lot of people at the firewood expo and very rarely do you meet a an old friend yesterday you know friends that you've you've got so much in common with i get a guy that emailed me today it's like we're separated at birth it's a guy i've never actually met before but our backgrounds are so similar and it was just just neat for him to reach out to me and and comment that this is what we got this is what going on in my life I do the same thing that you do. I've got the same machinery as you do. I'm at the same stage of life as you are. And it was just a, just a cool thing to connect with somebody. So anyway, I'm not gonna beat this video up anymore. I've said all I need to say about making a, this is my fourth cord now I'm making with this machine. So I'm gonna do six today and deliver it as well, which would be kind of cool. That's, a, a, that's about, a, a, about a dream day for us. We've done seven before, but it's too much. That's a lot. So Leslie's doing a few errands. She's going to be up to help finish, make this, fill this two cord trailer up. And then uh, I'm going to deliver the one cord and then bring it back empty and fill that up and deliver it again to the same place. So anyway, that's all I have to say about that. Over note, everybody.